Ahoy there, I'm Tiny Pirate. Welcome to Life in Bunker. Life in Bunker is a new game by Flox Studios. It will be out on the 25th of February. You can pre-order it at their, at their website. I'll put a link in the description. And it's about bunker management. Which is really a thing I've wanted to do for a very long time. So without further ado, let's get stuck in. What should we call this? Pirate Land. And off we go. Congratulations, you've just been elected as our new warden. That's me, I guess. A compulsory induction course follows. Shall we begin the course? Next. Move the camera around with a wizard. Oh, that's good. I think I can do that. Do, 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 do. Close and... Ooh. Ooh, yes, that works. Yep, Q and E to rotate. This is a development build, so I'm expecting the frame rates would have you to be... A little lower than I would like. F and G. Oh, I can also mouse wheel. Yes. Z. Oh, X. Oh, okay. What? Wait, okay. What does it want me to do? Time. Uh, time, time, time. Bunker time. Cool. I can see that wherever that is up there. Excellent. And uh, yes, uh, forward pause. Um, I tip the angle a bit. Z, Z, Z. It's not too much. That's fine. Uh, what's happening in this place? What are you people doing in my bunker? There's the entrance. Sealed for 50 cycles. That sounds like a good idea. Uh, next time. Main utilities. Main and utilities layers. Okay. An experienced warden knows that a bunker is not just floors and walls, but also a complex system of power and water grids. The bunker. Besides the ma main layer, right? Main layer. Which shows all the objects and residents has other layers. Water and power grid. Well, that makes sense. Yeah, push the buttons. Uh, oxygen is uh, required. They need fresh air. Oxygen level. Okay, good. We need to keep them breathing. We're familiar with that. We've played Planet Base. Uh, wide and deep underground levels. Oh, okay, so you can go up and down levels. We need to build lifts. Okay, good. So the nuclear war is above us, below lack of oxygen. Uh, stats with tab. Yep. Oop. Okay, let's have a quick look at the old water here. Huh. Water seems to be green. That that sounds like a good thing. And uh, power seems to be green too. And normal bunker view and stats view. Ooh. Oh, cool. Is, am I going to am I going to be able to manage people? Wow. Is this going to be my next favorite dwarf like? I think it is. I've been keeping my eye on this game for a for a few months, finally get a chance to play it. Uh, right, next on the stats. Um, that's why there's a range of different tools. So the cursor tool, fundamental structures, uh, infrastructure, yep, and destroy. Good. And there are many different... Ooh, oh my goodness, here are the resources. Uh, right, okay. Population, research points, garbage. Uh, building materials, or fruits, vegetables, grains, and fish. Hmm. Must remember gradual change of... How are we going to fish underground? Must be some kind of uh, fish culture tank. Right. Everyone must remember gradual change of generations. Uh, select the incubator. Each incubator can simultaneously sustain and produce up to three embryos. Press blah to commence production of new residents. Once the embryo is fully developed, a healthy child will appear. Okay, so they don't believe in such niceties as intercourse in this world. Um, do we want a couple of kids? Oh yes, we do. We want three kids. Just tell me there. Good. Professions. The bunker warden is in charge of distributing jobs among residents. Goody! The bunker residents are capable of doing many jobs, but every resident is unique. So give them a profession. Uh, bunker stats. The residents. Uh, da 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 da. Uh, select three and make them workers. Um, where was I? So are they? That's the worker thing. So what are you doing? Farmer? Well, we've got three workers already. That's fine. Um, let's just make one. Come on. Uh, can I make you a worker? No, what's... Um, right, what are you doing? 
Oh, you can't be a worker? Oh, I think I get it now. What am I doing? So these ones and these ones can be workers. Uh, and this one can be a worker as well. The rest of the time. Oh, that's just their skills. Oh, that's cool. So they don't all get to do everything. Hmm. Any future warden must know the bunker as every other home has garbage. Must be kept clean. No waste container. Okay, so pick someone and make them a janitor. So who's going to be a good janitor? Now what I really want to know is, can I rename people? Ah. Oh, can I would love to. I'll find out soon. Uh, cook. Uh, engineer. Janitor. Ivan, you can be a janitor. Yeah. At one point you won't have enough space to build new objects. That's when you have to knock down walls and do some digging. Uh, on one of the modes, choose destroy. Select a place we'd like to have a new room. Mark 10 by 10 tiles. Okay. Da, 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 da. Press. Uh, pro confirm it by pressing the button. And if you change your mind, you can cancel it. Oh, okay. So let me have a look here. Destroy. Um, where's going to be good to build? It would seem to make sense to build off the... To destroy this type of soil, we must... Oh, we got to research some... Oh. Okay. Interesting. So we can't just... Oh, look over here. Something strange is over there. Do we want to go that way? It would seem reckless and foolish to expand in that direction, but... Hey. That's my middle name. Um, no, we can't do that one yet. Uh, we can just... No, we can't do that. Let's just... Okay. No. Uh, come here. Uh, do, 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 do. We'll get a little corridor going. And... Uh, there's nothing moving over... Does okay, there is something moving. I don't know what that is. Um, we'll see if we can do this here. Okay, we'll just see if that works. Okay, what did it say? Uh, if you change your mind, okay, that's fine. Uh, by building floors, you automatically build ceilings as well. Thus, placing floors on clear ground protects it from landfills. Different types of flooring. Okay, some things can only be built on concrete. That makes sense. Flooring. Okay, so we, I guess we need to make, oh, we do have, do we have, we have builders out there. That's good. I mean, diggers. Do we need to add more? I'm curious. They're off doing their own uh, happy little job there. I think, oh, no, they do the digging. Okay, so workers do do that. What do you do? I'll, I'll put some people on farming who aren't otherwise engaged. Yeah, and uh, have some more workers. And uh, maybe a janitor, throw them like that, maybe. What do you do? Science. Science sounds good. Oh, look at them go for it now. Brilliant. Do we want to clear out this space too? I think so. Yep, add it to the list of things for them to do. Make it a good size space. Yep, go for it people. Can't get through those blocks yet. I'll just have to wait. What is it else is it saying to me about floors? Um, cool. Walls. Alright, well we'll just do that floor thing for now. Um, fundamental structures, floors, um, blue, red, concrete, or metal. We'll go for concrete, because I don't know what's going to be in here. Can we get that done, people? Donk, 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 donk. Sounds like that's easy enough done. Okay, so then we want, uh, right, when you right, walls, uh, build its walls, fundamental structures, walls, uh, place the icon, and plan the walls layer, da, da, da. okay, so fundamental structures, oh, yep, yeah. okay, that, um, walls, and, uh, yeah, a wall, can we, where do we put these walls? Can't build there. Oh, I see. We can build on the finished, the finished tiles. All right, that's fine. Um, I'll rotate this around here. Have you finished all of this? You have. Oh, good minions. 
Okay, I didn't leave them exactly with lots of room to get in here. And I really like the, the sort of dwarf fortress like elements to this. I'm getting, no, good. In your, in your way, get out of the way. I'm, I'm getting quite excited about that, I have to confess. Um, I kind of don't see that. Yeah, that's kind of a shame there. I can't. Hmm. Can I just destroy that corner? Do they have? No. There. Can they get in there? I don't know if they can. Oh, the walls do connect up nicely. That's great. All right. Looks like he can get into the corners. Very good. Uh, fundamental structure, floor, concrete. Yes, confirm that, and then the walls, 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 walls. Ah, good. Excellent. I'm liking this. I'm liking this a lot. Now, what else do we have to worry about? Okay, so we... Yeah, good, we got that. Didn't even need to read too much of that. Um, we need beds. Six single beds in the room you just built. Uh, okay. Uh, place the beds. So we need to go there. And then things, and then beds, and then... Uh, um, t uh, okay. But right, we'll do the beds first. Worry about building the beds. Now we know. <laughs> I am not going to be able to fit any in there. Ah, tiny boat. Silly, silly fool. Yeah, let's just expand this way. So I, I don't think I'm going to fit any in otherwise. Did we have enough? Yeah. Well, we are learning, so that's fine. We'll just take down all those things that we just carefully built, of course, because why wouldn't you do that when you're a bit of an egg? And, well, I think against here, we can just go ahead and start putting in our beds. So that's good news. Single bed. Um, one. Do they, uh, I don't know if they need to be... We'll just assume that they don't need to be next to each other. What do they take? 20... That must be like metal. Yeah, so it is. 20 of... Yeah, building materials. So that's going to be the garbage. Or... Okay. Alright, good, good, good. That's great. And that means flooring time. Uh, oh no, concrete. What am I saying? I wonder if they prefer the nicer... The nicer materials for their bedroom, but... You are in a bunker, people. There is a nuclear war above. It could be far worse. It could be red scorpions and so on invading your personal space. And prove that. And a wall here. Do I want to put in a wall? You know, I'm just going to just gonna leave it. They don't really need a wall, do they? I don't think they do. We may also need to expand. I don't want to tear everything down again. Mm. No, oh, not a fridge. What is, it, what, what is a fridge doing in here? Okay, bed. Uh, and there we go, that would be six. That would be perfect. Okay, uh, on the modes panel. Okay, cool. So on the modes panel, uh, pick the tab infrastructure and then choose residential zone and find the single bed. Okay. So, uh, main layer. Oh, where was I? Select structures. Oh, okay. Um, right, sweet smell of feces. <laughs> let's, okay, so let's wait for a sec. Let us find the... Uh, okay, wow, right. Just stop achieving at things. Whatever it is you guys are doing, stop it. Oh, we do want to tear down that bit of wall, though, so we can expand and put in stuff. So that's fine. I am pleased with you all. You are doing a fine job. Now, what was it I was looking for? Main layer? No, water layer. That looks okay. Power layer looks okay. So main layer. Uh, fundamental structures. Electricity and water. Don't need any of those right now. I think we'll go straight to... What was it saying? Uh smell of we must build two toilet cabinets and one shower pod okay select the tab infrastructure oh i see and then residential zone got you and then find the required objects and place them um residential zone so we need uh, two shower pods where should we put a shower pod 
Um, I think against oh, this wall here. Oh, they're quite big. Two shower pods and two toilet cabinets. Cabins. Toilet cabins. Who wants to go to toilet in a cabin? Hmm, never mind. Um, let's have a look here. Oh, just put one. And two. Alright, cool. T shower pods are done. How do I rotate these objects? I realized I skipped past that. I'll guess I'll figure it out in due course. So toilet cabins and shower pods have been built. Residents can't use them yet. They require water to function. Have to connect to the water grid. So select the water grid. And then on modes panel choose fundamental structures. Electricity and water. Water pipes. Draw the pipe to connect the toilet cabins and shower pods with the water grid. Oh, okay, that sounds sensible. All right, so that is the water grid there. So fundamental structures, electricity and water, water pipe. Um, that looks like a pipe there. See if that works. I'm thinking it will because I'm a highly experienced builder game player. I get. Well, do I? Oh, okay. So, <laughs> um, there's more grid over here. It looks like they can build it through the walls, potentially. Now, back to my... Oh, maybe they are. Maybe they... Maybe they are? They are? They sort of are? Come on, people. Let me see. Speed it up. No, you're just standing around. Oh, that's a shame. All of those words I said, and they were all lies. Um, right. Water pipe. Cancel those. That should do the trick, shouldn't it? They should be able to access those. Yeah, here we go. They're building it properly now. This is a bit of a poorly designed base, I must admit. Can they even get out of this out of this room? I'm not even sure they can. Um, let's just destroy that corner. Hopefully that will help. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Well, now they can get out. Hooray! Uh, yeah, we, we might fix this up one day. Um, and it looks like... We'll just put in a concrete tile there. Make it tidy. Well, this tutorial's been running for a little while. Probably a good idea we finish now and come back for another episode where we will continue to struggle in the bunker to keep everyone alive and happy and fed and that kind of stuff. Good night.